everyone. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. If you are still here after a whole almost entire year that I've been gone, February will be a whole entire year that I've been off of YouTube, which sounds absolutely crazy to say, but I definitely needed that break. And if you're still here and still following me, I want to thank you because I have been absent for so long. But 2021 was crazy. If I thought 2020 was crazy, 21 was absolutely, oof, it was crazy. A lot of ups and downs, but a lot of ups and a lot of learning and so on and so forth. I can do another video saying where I've been, but it has been a whirlwind and I am so happy to be back and sharing everything that I've purchased because I purchased a lot while I was gone. So I'm excited to share that with you. Let's go ahead and get started. If you guys have been following me for a while now, you guys know how much I absolutely love Christian Louboutin bags. I am just absolutely obsessed. So when I saw that this one had come out, I was like, I gotta have it. I have to have it, I have to have it. And it came out, I'm gonna say, just barely like one, maybe two, maybe two years ago. And I literally have been like eyeing it ever since. Let me show you what it came in. So it came in this cute box. I love the detailing that Christian Louboutin always does in their packaging. This is the inside of the box. I just love little things like that. Just so absolutely beautiful. All right, so it came just like this. And it came in this super cute dust bag. Oh my gosh. I'm used to the huge one and now I have a little baby one. I think I failed to mention that this bag was pre-loved, but she said that she had only used it one time and I completely believe it. She said she used it once and it wasn't for her. So she decided to list it. But like I said, this is a super cute little dust bag it came in. It came with absolutely everything. The care card, the card where she bought it from. She bought it from my Teresa. And then like the, the tags and everything. This is my cute new little baby. Oh my gosh. I like yelled so loud whenever I pulled it out and saw it for the first time. It is the cutest. I purchased this beauty at the beginning of 2022. It was probably like the first week of January. And I, oh my gosh, like I saw it and I was like, there's no way. I always scope my bags out, especially if they're pre-loved. And I always scope them out really good and give them a good wipe down. But honestly, it was in perfect condition. It, you couldn't even tell that she used it not even once. So it is just the cutest thing in the world. This is the bottom. Of course, you guys know he had to put his signature rubber sole on the bottom. So the strap is adjustable and I love that. I have already worn it like two different ways on the, you know, shorter and longer. And I love it, just the detail. It's like such a simple bag, but it still has so much detail. On the clasp here, you can see that it says Christian Louboutin. So the hardware is a gunmetal color, but I don't mind it at all. I would love to have this bag with gold hardware. I would definitely buy both bags, but I absolutely love it. Like you guys, if you guys previously have seen my other videos, my bigger Kabata comes with a little like pouch inside. This one obviously does not. This is the interior. I am just so in love. And like I said, I did purchase it um, earlier this month and I couldn't wait to use it. Like I literally, I think I moved into it that same day that I got it because I have been using this mama. Okay, you guys know that I can literally just like get off topic and just start talking about it instead of showing it to you. And I hate whenever I'm watching a video and I'm like, show me the freaking bag. So let me show you how freaking adorable this is. And I love that it's this kind of leather. It does not scratch easily. It's not that smooth leather. It's kind of pebbled leather. 
It smells amazing. You guys have your structured straps and I am just a sucker for structured straps because I've been like obviously changing purses um, at work and stuff and I put it in a certain spot on my desk. I love when I set my bag down and the straps stay up and of course like on my Louis Vuitton Neverfull they just kind of slouch and on my Gucci Ophidia toe they slouch, slouch down and I just love there's just something about structured straps that I love. Let me show you guys what it looks like with this beautiful strap. I'm like I'm obsessed and sometimes like when I have all black on, I just put it on like this and even though it's not kind of, it's not really reversible, but I still wear it like that and I don't care. I think that is super, super sleek and just, oh, there's just something about Christian Louboutin and his red signature. I am obsessed. I, I feel like I'm more obsessed with the bags than I am with the shoes. There's a lot of shoes. I'm not going to tell you. I'm not going to lie and say I'm not obsessed with his shoes. I am, but I have more bags of Christian Louboutin than I do his shoes. And look at this cutie. Oh my gosh. I am so obsessed with her. Like you don't even know. I have purchased a, um, insert for this bag but it has not come in yet i do want to keep um something in here because i am going to do another video of my christian louboutin um card holder that i purchased and it was less than 80 dollars and yes it's completely authentic but i'm going to show it in a different video whenever i show my insert that i bought for this bag because you guys are going to flip like I'm obsessed. But anyways, I don't want it to pretty much mess up or dent the interior of the bag. So I definitely want to buy a small little um, organizer. Like I said, I either am, if I'm not at school, I'm not, I'm wearing this one. And then when I am at school, I've been wearing this one. Like I wore this one today and I wore this one yesterday. And this is the mama of it. And I have to, I have used this bag a lot. It just goes with everything. It's absolutely stunning. Of course, they have so many different designs, but I love this one. I don't have the regular black one. So this is the only regular black one that I do have. But um, I love this one because it's like different, but it's still like you can scratch it and you can't even tell like, you can't even tell that I have used it as much as I have. And you can see like on this hardware, it is black. It's black and then this one's the gun metal. So there's a difference definitely. But I have used this one like crazy and it's still in really good condition. I haven't looked at the bottom. See the bottom is in impeccable condition as well. And I have used this one a lot. So, but like there's a lot of pros and cons. I definitely need to do another video that is more um, focused on pros and cons on this bag because I have gotten a lot of use of a lot of my different ones that I have. This isn't the only one I have. I have different ones. I'll link them all down below. Okay, I'm just like really excited to be back and I keep going on and on and blabbering. You guys already know how I do. All right, let me do some mod shots for you guys. All right, so this is what it looks like on. Let me show you. And this is with the like little adjustable. I don't really like that this kind of stands up a little bit, but I've literally like tried to kind of curl it in and I'll even take it off and unhook it. But I don't know, that's really not a big deal, but I'm like always a perfectionist with my bags. And this is where it hits you. Like sometimes I'm shopping and I just kind of throw it to the back and continue to do what I'm doing. I just realized that I completely forgot to mention that it does have a hook like the um, bigger Kabatas do, but they are just like that. It has a little hook, okay? That's not much closure. It doesn't have a zipper or anything like that, so you just have to be, be really careful with it. This is it on your shoulder. So this is them together. This is the mini. And this is the large. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and let you go and cut myself off because I feel like I'm just talking your head off now. But I am so excited to be back. And please like this video if you guys enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And follow me on TikTok if you guys are on TikTok. 
I will talk to you very soon. I have so many things lined up um, to show you guys and share with you. I'm just so excited to be back. I will see you very soon in another video. Mwah! Bye, guys.